Hi everyone. In this video, we're going to look at the top 5 best e-readers in 2024. We made this list based on our own opinions, research, and customer reviews. We've considered their quality, features, and values when narrowing down the best choices possible. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description box below. So, here are the top 5 best e-readers. The fifth product on our list is Kobo Sage. The Kobo Sage is another feature-packed e-reader. It can also play audiobooks and podcasts and can serve as a versatile digital notebook. It's more compact than the Scribe, but the Sage still handles handwritten notes using the optional Kobo stylus. Even better, unlike the Scribe, the Sage is waterproof. The e-ink display is glare-free and can be viewed clearly in any light from direct sunlight to a dark room. It's also designed to reduce eye strain and allow for more comfortable reading and writing. While avid readers have access to the Kobo store and can purchase eBooks or audiobooks individually, you can also subscribe to Kobo Plus Read for $7.99 per month to get unlimited access to more than 1.5 million eBooks. For $9 per month, the subscription plan offers unlimited access to Kobo's eBook and audiobook library which contains more than 150,000 titles. What we really like about the Kobo Sage is that it works easily and seamlessly with OverDrive's Libby service. So when the Sage is connected to the internet via Wi-Fi, you can borrow eBooks and audiobooks for free from your local public library. Up next in fourth place is the Books Tab Ultra C Pro. Books is one of the first companies to create e-readers and Android tablets with full-color e-paper displays. An e-paper display is basically e-ink tech, but with full color, so the screen can be viewed glare-free in almost any lighting situation. The device's battery lasts for weeks, not mere hours, like a traditional tablet. You can either think of the BooksTab Ultra C Pro as an e-reader on steroids with a full color display, or as an Android-based tablet with somewhat limited functionality. While the device runs Android 12 and has a powerful processor, the refresh rate and resolution of the unit's color e-paper display can't handle detailed, full-color photos or smooth video content. As an e-reader, it works with any e-reader app on the Google Play Store, including Amazon Kindle, BN Nook, Rakuten Kobo, or Libby, for borrowing e-books from a public library. With its dual stereo speakers and internet connectivity, the BooksTab Ultra C Pro can also play audiobooks or podcasts and stream music. In addition to including a stylus that allows you to handwrite or draw directly on the Tab Ultra C Pro's display, optional accessories include a detachable keyboard with a built-in trackpad. This upgrades the device even more, letting you handle word processing, web surfing, or email. Reading full-color ebooks, newspapers, and magazines is a pleasure. The tablet is also extremely customizable, we love that it can be used as a more compact digital note-taking device, compared to the Scribe. It can even automatically transcribe your handwritten notes into editable text. Like the iPad, the BooksTab Ultra C Pro has a split-screen mode, so you can run two apps at once. This makes multitasking easy. Yes, the BooksTab Ultra C Pro is expensive, but it can serve as a powerful e-reader and note-taking tool and perform many, but not all, tasks that a traditional Android-based tablet can do. The screen is large and easy to read. The colors displayed using the e-paper display, however, are not remarkably vibrant. The third product on our list is the Amazon Kindle Scribe. The Amazon Kindle Scribe is a full-featured ebook reader and audiobook and podcast player, but it also offers another cool feature that other Kindles don't. It's a digital notepad. You can handwrite or draw directly on the display using a stylus. Using the note-taking app, you can create custom digital notebooks and then fill them up with individual pages containing thoughts or sketches. These notes are stored within the scribe, but can easily be shared when the e-reader is connected to the internet via Wi-Fi. As you're reading, you can annotate the content of e-books with handwritten notes or annotate PDF files transferred to the Scribe using the internet-based Send to Kindle feature. A basic stylus comes with the Scribe, 
but a premium pen can be purchased separately. The benefit of the premium pen is that the top serves as a digital eraser, just like on a pencil. Either model attaches to the side of the scribe using magnets. A three-month trial subscription to the Kindle Unlimited service is included, as is a USB Type-C charging cable. The scribe uses a manually adjustable e-ink display that can be viewed in any lighting situation, including direct sunlight. In a dark room, the 35 integrated LEDs brighten the screen so can easily see the display. With the scribe, you get all of the features of a Kindle e-reader combined with useful note-taking tools. The second product on our list is the Amazon Kindle. Especially when it goes on sale, the Amazon Kindle is the least expensive Kindle e-reader in Amazon's lineup. It offers a 6-inch display, but it's not as sharp as a paper-white display, especially in direct sunlight. And in dark areas, it only offers four non-adjustable LEDs. But the 16 gigabyte of internal storage is enough to store thousands of e-books or hundreds of audiobooks. This Kindle can also play audiobooks or podcasts. Without a built-in speaker, you'll need to pair the device with wireless headphones or earbuds to listen to any audio content. Unlike the Kindle Paperwhite e-readers, this model is not waterproof, but it does offer a compact and easy-to-hold design. It comes with a three-month trial subscription to Amazon's Kindle Unlimited, which provides unlimited access to more than 4 million e-books and audiobooks. The device also works seamlessly with an Audible subscription for listening to audiobooks and podcasts. If you like to buy your content one title at a time, this can be done directly from the Kindle when it's connected to Wi-Fi by accessing the Kindle store. Once content is loaded into the device, however, no ongoing internet connection is needed. You can easily read on an airplane, cruise ship, or anywhere Wi-Fi service is not offered. Before we reveal number one, be sure to check out the description below for the newest deals on each of these items, and be sure to subscribe if you want to stay up to date on the best products on the market. Finally, our top product title name is the Amazon Kindle Paperwhite Signature Edition. As its name suggests, the Amazon Kindle Paperwhite Signature Edition is a slightly more feature-packed edition of the popular Kindle Paperwhite e-reader. This version supports wireless charging using any Qi-compatible charger, or it can be charged via a wired USB Type-C connection. The display's brightness and contrast are auto-adjusting based on the ambient light around you, but you can manually adjust the brightness and color temperature of the display to accommodate your preferences. And this version of the Kindle is waterproof. Plus, it can serve as an audio player for audiobooks or podcasts. Since they are no internal speakers, you'll need to pair the device with your choice of wireless headphones or earbuds, sold separately. This e-reader also comes with a three-month trial subscription to Kindle Unlimited. This service offers access to more than 4 million e-books, audiobooks, and related content. After that, the monthly fee is $11.99. However, you can also buy e-books or audiobooks individually from the Kindle store directly from the device when it's connected to the internet via Wi-Fi. Just reading e-books or listen to downloaded doesn't require an internet connection. That's all for our list of the five best e-readers on the market. Head over to the description below for links to more detailed info on each of the products. And remember to leave a comment to let us know your opinion. Thanks for watching. If we helped you out in any way, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. We'll see you guys in the next video.